Hi guys, welcome to my new tutorial. In this tutorial, I am gonna show how to make this little motion design with After Effects. Let's get started. Vectors from freepick.com, I will add download link and project files. Select this background and lock. Select this laptop. Height, mouse height. And okay. First step, let's create new null object for fake parallax. Change name, null object, camera, camera fake. And select this builds, and select this builds, layer Z, clothes, floor, hoop, object to object one, and ball. Parent to this camera fake. Okay, let's select these two layers again. Parent to this null object okay select this null object press p and move to up okay make new keyframe and let's select work area go to 10 seconds press n right mouse and select work area okay and go to one second move to dom like this and select this keyframes, right mouse, keyframe ascent, easy is. Go to graph editor and make smooth graph. Let's see. Okay, select this keyframe, move to right. Okay, then select this layer Z, like this. Press P, make new position keyframe. Go to here and Move to down, okay, and select this keyframe, move to left, select keyframes, right mouse, keyframe asset, easy, easy, and go to graph editor, select this graph, move to left, let's see, okay, this is fake parallax, okay, and select this keyframe, move to down, let's see again, Okay, nice parallax. Let's see again. Okay. Select this builds, press P, make new keyframe. Go to here and move to up like this. Let's see. Okay, nice. Select keyframes, right mouse, keyframe asset, easy easy. Okay, camera animation not bad. Okay, go to here, select this ball and press P, move to down. Okay. And in this time, make new position keyframe. Go to here and move to up and move to left. Okay, and go to here, move to down. Okay, like this. Let's select this three keyframe, right mouse, keyframe ascent, easy is. And go to graph editor, select this graph, move to left, and this, move to right. Let's see. Okay, let's select these keyframes, hold ALT, move to right, okay, then select this keyframe, go to pencil and let's make smooth line, okay, let's see. Okay, select this three keyframe again, go to graph editor and click selection tool and select this line, move to left, let's see, okay, select this two keyframe, hold alt, move to left and select these two keyframes, move to left.
Okay. So in this time, select this ball, hold shift, press air, make rotation keyframe, go to here, and change rotation. Let's see. Okay. Select these keyframes, right mouse, keyframe as easy is. And hold shift, press S, open scale. Okay. Select these keyframes, move to right. Okay. Move to right again. And in this time, first keyframe, make scale keyframe and click this icon. Go to here. Again, make new keyframe and change scale and go to here change 100 okay and in this time select this keyframe change scale like this okay in this time again change 100 for change scale Okay, let's select these two keyframes, move to here, okay, not bad. Select this keyframe, let's change this line, okay. Okay, not bad. Select this scale, right mouse, keyframe and say easy is. Okay, nice. In this time, again, make new keyframe, this null object, fake camera. Go to here and move to down like this. Okay, and select this two keyframe, go to graph editor and make smooth graph. Okay, and in this time select this ball, move to down. Okay, let's select this laptop and unhide and move to here. Press S, change scale. Okay, let's see. Select this ball. Okay, let's see again. Let's select this ball and move to center this notebook. Select this laptop, move to here. And select this last ball keyframe. Move to here to center. Okay, let's go to shapes and let's create ellipse tool or rounded range tool and hold shift make one rounded tool add name button and let's close stroke open fill color Select this color, this ball color, okay.
and parent to this shape layer laptop okay so in this time open button options range of one and range of part one change roughness and click this icon change scale to convert circle okay and move to here press s change scale and double click this icon for import anchor point to center okay and in this time press p make position keyframe go to here and move to center this circle let's see okay select this button and ball click this icon for motion blur and this icon okay select keyframes right mouse keyframe assistant easy and open again contents range of one range of part one and in this time let's click size keyframe go to 10 keyframe again and change size make smooth keyframes let's see okay and go to text and let's make play text go to character change scale font okay and go to window open animation composer open text open this animate characters position scale overshot and this button okay let's see okay nice in this time let's select this mouse unhide move to up here and move to down and press p make position keyframe go to here move to here okay make smooth keyframe let's see keyframe speed okay very speedily let's change speed okay select the keyframes go to graph editor and make smooth graph and in this time let's change graph and make smooth line and hold shift press air make rotation keyframe go to here change rotation and here change again make smooth keyframes let's see and select this apply text parent to this button select this button press s make scale keyframe 
go to 6 keyframe 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 chain scale go to again 6 keyframe 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 select first keyframe, ctrl C, ctrl V and select these keyframes make smooth let's see okay nice and select this camera press p make new position keyframe go to here and move to down for loop animation and press n go to first second select work area right mouse like this okay let's see Okay, not bad. Select these keyframes, go to graph editor and make smooth graph. Okay, press B again select work area for speed to the loop animation. Okay, nice. Okay, not bad. So thank you for watching my tutorial and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.